now we're in the final stretch of election season, and this weekend a popular political TV show has reunited. Actors from West Wing are in Madison to campaign for Kamala Harris and Tim Walz. And our Meryl Hubbard got an exclusive interview with one of the stars. West Wing wrapped up its final season in 2006, but here in 2024, some of the cast members have rejoined to motivate support for the Harris campaign. Madison! Four cast members are in Madison to rally Democrats and undecided voters ahead of the election. Bradley Whitford, Mary McCormick, Richard Schiff, and Martin Sheen all started with a meetup on Madison's east side with a couple dozen canvassers. For Whitford, this is a return home. He is a Madison local that grew up on the east side and is passionate about getting more Wisconsin voters out to the polls this election. He spoke about how his dad used to work for Planned Parenthood in Madison. You know, he was a man who felt that uh, women deserved agency over their own bodies, and that's what I grew up with. That's what I think the majority of people in Wisconsin are, are, uh, are, are looking for. In turn, Whitford is advocating for women's reproductive freedom, gun safety, and an opportunity economy. We know what the stakes are in this election. The same, you know, this ain't no stick in television show. The West Wing cast concluded their Madison campaign tour with a meeting at the Barrymore Theater, where local supporters took their seats to hear from the celebrity speakers. After hearing from the cast, they all wrapped up by singing America the Beautiful in unison. Reporting on Madison's East Side, Meryl Hubbard, News 3 Now. Merrill, thank you. Now we have a response from WISH GOP Chairman Brian Schimming, and he says, perhaps the cast can finally share their secret plan to fight inflation since Kamala Harris does not have one. 